How can we help you in avoiding the next devastating cryptocurrency scam? Well, it's by displaying the key indicators that your money isn't safe. And to do so, we'll tell you a true story about a billion dollar fraud, a year long international manhunt, and the possibility of the world's largest crypto prison sentence. But while we're telling you this, let's see how many key warning signs you can spot. Clue, there are seven of them. Hey, welcome to Stock Market Mate. Today we'll talk about the seven crypto danger signs most people don't know about. Before we get into it, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell to help us beat the YouTube algorithm. If you're done with that, then let's get right into it. The Thodex Exchange So Turkey in 2021. Your hard-earned life savings in Lira are depreciating day by day. Inflation is out of control. 15%, 16%, 17%. Your daily sentences are becoming more expensive by the day. You must find a way out. You need to keep your money safe and you manage to do so. Crypto, specifically the exchange Thodex. Although the name sounds like a Marvel reject, the opportunity appears to be legitimate. This could be the solution. Simply convert your Lira to Bitcoin and you're done. There will be no more inflationary words and you may even make money while you're at it. It's perfect, it's only getting better. Thodex is distributing millions of free Dogecoin. It almost appears too good to be true. You go ahead and do it. You convert your Lira to cryptocurrency, but then you begin to worry again. Just keep in mind that cryptocurrency in Turkey are not regulated, but it's massive, right? It is widely used. You may have noticed that Turkey is home to 16% of all cryptocurrency users. Every day, a million transactions take place. And Thodex has hundreds of thousands of users who store their money there instead of in their wallets. Lots of faith. What possibly could go wrong? Freezing accounts. The government says it will completely ban cryptocurrency at the end of the month. Everyone's crypto. Your crypto. It's a disaster. Then Thodex begins selling Dogecoin for 11 cents, far below the market value. Within 24 hours, they exchanged 500 million tokens. Something isn't quite right here. You do not want to be frozen as a result of some law. It's time to withdraw your funds. We've learned in crypto that if things feel shaky, it's time to leave before everyone else freaks out. However, they are not processing withdrawals. That's strange. However, positive rumors begin to circulate. These new laws are on their way, but they may only prevent you from purchasing items with cryptocurrency. According to speculations, you can still invest. Maybe everything will be fine in the end. When you've barely recovered from your shop, the exchange goes offline. The letter is sent to users stating that it will be unavailable for four or five days while they consider a business offer from quote, world-renowned banks and fund companies they don't even name. You want to believe it, but it doesn't seem right. What are you supposed to do at this point? Should I tweet them? Sure, best of luck. That's when Thodex's lawyers intervened. Essentially, things are not going well. Thodex's assets declined as the market fell. Now they don't have enough money to pay everyone who is attempting to withdraw money insolvency. This is the worst thing that could happen to your cryptocurrency. So you begin your search for any and all answers. You have your savings, but they have spent it. How exactly does that work? After all, it's your money. Thodex's main man. Finally, you come across the man responsible for the Thodex exchange. He's Farouk. Everyone wants their money back, and you're all attempting to contact Farouk. And does he respond? No. He's gone missing. Nowhere to be found, or according to the lawyer, he's dead. Okay, this is the absolute worst thing that could happen to your cryptocurrency. It's a classic crypto scam. If you lose or steal a lot of money, you should just disappear for good. So thousands of people are looking for this guy, and finally, there's a breakthrough. Farouk is found the next day. It should be good news. Except he's in an Albanian airport. He has already fled the country and could be anywhere in the world. As a result, the cops issued an international arrest warrant. You're waiting for Farouk to be apprehended when Thodex makes another long rambling statement. They tell the world that their main man has left the country to meet with those mysterious investors. They're not sure whom to believe anymore. It is rumored that $2.5 billion were lost or stolen. That is a large sum of lira. It's plausible given the Thodex exchange's reported client base of hundreds of thousands. Then the investigators reveal even more shocking information. Thodex transferred 5,000 bitcoins to the Kraken exchange a month before Farouk's departure. At the time, it was worth $125 million. It's a clear con job. Several people were arrested, including Farouk's brother and sister. It turns out that those siblings recently made unfathomable fortunes. We're not sure where that came from. However, the main man is still missing. The 7 Crypto Warning Signs What will happen next? And have you noticed the seven clear signs proving the Thodex operation was a hoax? 
Before we tie up those loose ends, Thodex was a popular exchange that existed since 2017, and it vanished in the blink of an eye. As more officers were assigned to the case, they finally found their man in Albania after a year of searching high and low. He attempted to disguise himself by shaving his head. However, biometric tests confirmed that it was him, so he's been captured. Does that mean you'll get your money back? No. The Turkish government has charged 21 people, and they want to imprison Farouk and his associates for more than 40,000 years, one of the world's longest sentences. Sadly, there is no happy ending here. Not only did thousands of people lose their savings, but it is also possible that cryptocurrency freedom in Turkey has come to an end. The government continues to want control of digital currencies, which means more legislation. Some even believe the government is behind the whole thing. They claim this because the Thodex collapse occurred immediately following the announcement of the crypto ban. Let's get back to the video's challenge. What were the warning signs that would have prevented you from falling victim to this scam? Did you manage to catch them? Let's look. Number 1. Unfeasibly large offers. A warm welcome is wonderful, but if it is overwhelming, something is wrong. As a bonus, Thodex provided millions of free Dogecoin, an offer so ridiculous that red flags should have flown. Number 2. This was an unregulated exchange. Find a regulated exchange in a country where cryptocurrency is legal. If it's unregulated, as it was in Turkey, the exchange owners can get away with a lot more. Number 3. Selling coins for unrealistic prices. Don't fall for outrageous discounts. These are currencies. If you see this happening on an exchange, leave immediately. Thodex was selling Dogecoin for a much lower price than the listing price. This should have been the clearest red flag imaginable. Number 4. Withdrawals are slow or impossible. If you read reports of slow or frozen withdrawals, it may be too late. However, as soon as this occurs, you must move your money. When Thodex began freezing withdrawals, it became clear that something strange was going on at this exchange. Number 5. The exchange goes offline for a flimsy reason. Be wary of rumors of liquidity problems or an exchange going offline, if you are unable to do anything once your account has been frozen. A working exchange is a business. Businesses do not go offline at random. They want to be online if they want to make money. When this occurs, it indicates that something is seriously wrong. Number 6. Owners running away. Farouk disappeared and then reappeared in random countries as if he'd stepped out of a taken movie. What else do we need to say? Number 7. Owners cashing out. It's too late if you start hearing that the money has been stolen. As a result, before using an exchange, you should learn as much as possible. Do you have faith in the people involved? Do they have a checkered past? If this is the case, you should reconsider investing. Those are warning signs to be on the lookout for. To recap, unfeasible large offers, unregulated exchange, selling coins for unrealistic prices, withdrawals are slow or impossible, the exchange going offline for a flimsy reason, owners running away, and owners cashing out. Well, that's about it for today. If you find this video helpful, kindly click the like and subscribe button. Also, you might want to leave a comment below. We love hearing from you. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, you're going to want to watch one of these two videos right here. Enjoy!